Hey, what's going on crew? It's your boy Sharana. Welcome back to the channel. If you're new to the crew, make sure you subscribe. Get notified for more videos just like this. But if you're already a part of the crew, salute. So today we're gonna take a look at the almost two year old iPad, the seventh gen and um, talk about this device, 10 reasons to consider picking this device up. We're gonna talk about a lot of features about this tablet. This isn't just a normal tablet. Um, it kind of changes the question from what can it do to what can it do? Because this device actually um, still has a lot of power to it. Um, a lot of different things I could do with this thing. It's still got the A10 Fusion chip. Uh, the latest software on Apple um, as well, which is pretty crazy. It's pr still really zippy, no lag on this thing. Um, as far as graphics, really solid for gaming, but we're gonna get into it right now. We're gonna talk about this thing. It has a 10.2 inch display and um, it's really solid. It has a fingerprint sensor right here at the bottom, which is like a touch button, home touch button. So it's really solid. You can get to your features on your home screen right here. Uh, we also do have long touch and we do have access to getting more widgets and things of that nature. The uh, value that you're going to be getting with this device. Now I do have, do use this thing a, a lot and mainly when I'm in the house, I use it on this keyboard. This thing literally has a mouse and a keyboard option on it. So now that I'm in, I could literally use the mouse, get to YouTube right here. Okay, I'm in there. Um, watch some but see Butler videos right here, or I could scroll right here. If I want to search, I could search, or I could go down right there to my recents. Let's get out there and help people customize and save. So this is the other thing: is that this thing has really good speakers, really good speaker quality on here. So. Not only that, the touch responsiveness to this is really super high quality. When you're watching videos, anything like that, it's gonna be like a laptop experience when you have the keyboard on here. If I'm, if I'm outdoors, I put the Mobozi case on here, the um, Vanguard case from, Mo, from Mobozi. But um, this one is like an armored case, you could, it's durable, and it's got that um, polycarbonate uh, shell on it. So. This is a solid device, like I said before. Has really bright colors, really, really good color accuracy. The uh, aleophobic coating on the top of the front panel. Um, and as far as the display, we're getting a full HD display on this guy, as you can see right here. And um, it's got an 8,827 milliamp hour battery, which, which will last weeks on standby. And um, you get 32 gigabytes on this model, but uh, 2160 times 1620 is the display ratio, just in case you wanted to know that. But um, this multi-touch button has a variety of different options on here. Also, um, not only are the updates good on here and the performance, uh, you can get pretty much all your apps through Apple um, Market and everything like that. And if you want a game on this device, um, it's gonna run really good on PUBG. Uh, this thing has a solid metal design on it all around the, 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 the body of here. It's full, like a full metal um, design. So a lot of people, you know what I'm saying, um, who, who use tablets are really gonna appreciate that, especially with the, the, the speakers that you're getting on the bottom of here are really loud and um, they sound really good, you know what I mean? So I definitely like them, but everywhere else it's gonna be like at least three, 370 or something like that. But you could, you could put this thing on HDR with ultra graph uh, frame rates on here. So you can see that's pretty crazy. Easy, they get really clear and um, that they just have some really good quality to them. You can see right here, the graphics look super quick. Um, so 
so the, the fusion chip is really zippy everything like that um you can get to everything that you want to do they also have the desktop mode so like it lets me get into this the desktop mode when i'm browsing through different um websites and things like that so you know it does let you go on facebook on here and instagram as well so you know i mean it feels really it's like a good experience when you're using those websites instagram facebook and you could use them on the the way you don't have to download the app you could just go on the browser and it feels like a desktop experience so i, I definitely like using you know facebook on here just like that so you can see you don't have to necessarily download the apps you could just use um the safari which is really cool so or your stories come up and everything like that you could use it in this mode or this mode which is the vertical mode it gets a little bit warm right about here when you're gaming but that's not really an issue it still feels really nice in the hand it does get cold to the, the touch when i'm using it out when i'm when i'm first picking it up in the middle of the night just to use it so i, I really like that about it um but you could read your emails on this thing you can get a lot of work done you could also do a lot of gaming on this device uh, like I said, social media works really easy on this thing as well. Um, if you want to get to your social media, you can see Instagram has the, the, the cutout right there. It's like a rectangle. So just keep that in mind. But um, everything just seems to look really nice on here. And like I said, the speakers on here are really good. Let me just go to something with some sound to it. It has some some hit some hit to the speakers. So you also do get a uh, uh, eight megapixel rear camera and a sixty. Uh, I think it's a twelve megapixel on the front, if I'm not mistaken. It's uh, you know, what I'm saying eight on the on the rear for sure, and then twelve on the front. So that's definitely. So you could do like FaceTime on here as well. You know what I'm saying? If you have like a, a phone, you can connect to it as well and, and use the ecosystem that Apple has. But you know what I mean? I, I, I just tend to use this by itself without anything connected to it. I'm, I might put ear pods to it, but um, it's just a really solid piece of hardware right now. But let me know what you guys think about this thing. Um, would you use the iPad 2019 right now? I definitely like watching like Netflix on here um, You know YouTube things of that nature um, You know anything that you want you can watch on here you, you know, They got black lightning one of my favorite shows You can see uh, just picks up right where you left off And it has that picture in picture mode for the Netflix. Um, the YouTube doesn't have it yet. Like if I'm in YouTube, you, you could do that, but only in the Safari. You have to be on the YouTube in um, the Safari for that to happen. So let me show you what I was talking about. Like if you're in YouTube, you can um, on Safari, you could definitely do it. So let's just see if there's any videos that like the top 10 highlights right here. So I guess if you're watching a video right now and you're, you press play. These days, there is a lot to balance. And you, you press back, it'll actually go into the side of the, the screen and you can continue, continue using it. So I think that's pretty cool because um, Safari does give you that option, but not the main YouTube app. So just keep that in mind. But you have maps on here. You have the app store as well, which you have a, a, a ton of apps that you could use on here. But I use this thing literally um, every day and, I, and um, I charge it about almost 
like once a week because I don't really use it like that that long. I might use it for like 15 minutes at a time and the battery is really good for standby time. So it's really good for when you're not using it. It's really a battery efficient. So I really like that part about the uh, Apple um, Fusion chip inside of here. But um, the speakers, the screen quality, the display, the, the build quality, the premium, um, you know what I'm saying? feel on it it doesn't depreciate as well so you could definitely resell it and get you get a lot of money you won't lose a lot of money on this device as well it's got a lot of accessories that you can use on it as well but um i definitely like the features on here it has a lot to offer um you can you can get a lot of different um things done on here as far as work as far as the pixels per inch it's 265 for the ppi that home touch button as well is really nice. You don't have to use like face ID or anything like that, but let me know what you guys think about the um, Apple iPad 2019 um, LCD IPS display on this guy. Gold, silver, gray are the color options. And um, it's about a, almost two years in with this with this device um, being released. So I've, been, I've had it for about a year now, so I think it's a, still a really solid option right now. So let me know what you guys think down below. But if you found this video helpful in any way possible, hit the like button, show your support and appreciation. And um, I'm going to get right back with you, but I'm going to see you in the comment section down below. So I'll, I'll see you there right now. I'm going to but make sure you hit one of the videos on the left or the right hand side of the screen. But I'm going to check you guys later. So uh, I'll get right back with you. Peace.